there is much at stake not only for these companies, but also for the US. Innovation has been the cornerstone of American exceptionalism over the past half century. But China is mounting a very serious challenge to the US technology leadership. This is why Washington is in a hurry to control the design, the manufacturing, and the deployment of these advanced chips that will power the coming AI revolution. Whether it is Trump's 100% tariffs on semiconductor imports, or reports that the US government is considering taking a strategic equity stake in Intel, it is very clear that Washington is determined to win the tech race at any cost. But what could possibly go wrong? He claims that 95% of AI pilots at the enterprise level do not have any PL impact. It found that 60% of organizations evaluated enterprise grade systems, but only 20% reach pilot stage and just 5% reach production. The issue is that AI forgets context, does not learn, and does not evolve. The paper describes the problem as high adoption but low transformation. This is why the MIT report is a sobering read. It implies that the hyperscalers are pouring money into a technology that is not ready for prime time.